guys, it's Ursus Avenge, and welcome back to Wings SMP. In the last episode, we went mining, and we were absolutely terrified by everything. But look, I have a mailbox now, guys. I have I have a place to put my things, and if I'm not mistaken, we have our first pair of wings. We can finally fly. This is actually really exciting. We also got some berries, which is pretty great because I love making the sandwiches. Ooh, we got a backpack. How do I... Backpack? Backpack. Backpack. Okay, cool. That's pretty neat. Very cute. Can I put this on? Oh my god. This is probably the greatest thing. Oh, holy flutter, this is so cute. Oh, this is perfect. I am the perfect butterfly fairy. I'm excited, guys. Guys, we can fly. They match our outfit perfectly. I'm pretty excited about this. But anyways, today's episode, we are going to be teaming up with Parashi so she can help me find a place to build my house. I have a slight plan, but things never go according to plan. So we're going to hopefully build my house today and uh, find a place to live. And um, I mean, we have our wings. So that was, that was kind of the rest of my plan. I was going to go mining for a bit, but we can just build our house and... Uh, and enjoy our wings. We are actually able to build in creative, so I'm going to get as crazy as I can with creative. I'm excited. I hope you guys are excited. Let's go meet up with Parashi. It's oh! <gasps> we can punch each other. How I did not. Friendly? I did not know that, but now I know. I'm not okay. <laughs> and I won't forget that, Parashi. <laughs> Anyways, huh? so uh, I hear that you you know where we could build. I know where there's a lot of things you can build at. But I know where the majority of people are at at the moment. Okay. Is this a question? Is you would be with the little group of people, but just like space out enough so you can build yourself a farm and stuff and live? I mean, to be fair, my plans are a little bit less terrestrial. Um, I'm actually going to be building in the sky. <gasps> so, uh, I don't need a lot of land space because I can build up. Up. That's smart. Yeah. Bird. I have a blue jay egg. I have a lot of blue jay eggs at home. If I'm gonna. That bird. I'm gonna. <laughs> oh, I just got another one. I am very Did sorry, you, baby bird. You birthed a baby. She's outside. I'm sorry. Live your life, baby bird. Live your life. So, how do we go about building? I hear we can build in creative, and I kind of yes, want to take full advantage. Where are the buttons? I think they set up top there floor. No. Oh, they're right there. <gasps> they're on the floor. <laughs> My game has changed to survival. I'm in creative! Woo! Yeah. Now I want to know what's all the way up here. I know, that's the first thing I did too. What's <laughs> all the Ooh, way up there? Ooh, there's enchanting over here. There's mm -hmm. a camera. There are emeralds for some reason. We all questioned what was up there until we got into creative mode and we we're like, oh, <laughs> that's what's up here. Like, we can do this. All right, so take me to uh, where we can build. Whee! Whee! First time I'm flying on the server and I'm not even using my wings. <laughs> See, I have Angel. That's somebody's house. Oh, whose houses are these? That's Angel's over here. With the pink roof? Oh, wait, that castle over That's there? That's Bree's. That's okay, so this is Bree's house. That one's yours with the kitty ears, I can tell. Yes. <laughs> it um, like everybody can tell what my house is. What's this one? That's the one I'm working on right now. That's the one you're working on? Okay. Your tower. Okay. And then you said and this one over Angel. here is Angels. See. This one's- Oh, look at the vines. Are those little tiles? Um, she did chisel and bits. Oh, we had that's and the bits one. That's the one. That's so cute. Because this is all me, me and Angel like to do is chisel a bit. <laughs> yeah. As soon as I saw it was included, I was like, oh no. <laughs> it's like, we're going to spend hours doing that. I mean, these, if you see my circle window I have on top of my house, you see how long oh it takes me to do things. Oh my gosh. That's crazy. It's like I had to do it. it it's so cute. There. So, a lot of people are trying to live in this general person. The pretty, the pretty flower really. place. Yeah, that's, everybody that's likes fair. the pretty flower biome. Okay, so we can basically either choose that. What's over here? Try oh, it that. looks like <laughs> there's just like a bridge over here, but I don't know if that's somebody's house. No, I think Angel's is building bridges now. Oh, she's just building bridges for fun? Yeah, that's Angel. <laughs> okay. Yeah. She has this labeled as a, as a farm area, so I'm not going to build over there. Um, but I could build over the water here. That'd be cute. Yeah, I'm going to be doing a floating island anyway, so it doesn't necessarily need to 
be over land. And actually, I'm gonna do waterfalls too, so this might actually work out. Yeah. And this ran between a lot of people, and I'm not that far away from spawn. About- f oh wait, no. It's 350, that's- that's fair. Do you think anybody will mind if I build here? I don't think anybody would. Okay. At all. I know Angel wouldn't mind either. This is this me and Angel over here in this area. Yeah. My only concern is that she'd want to use this land- well, I mean, she could still use this land, to be honest, if she wants to fill out this whole area, because I'm just gonna be building over the water and then behind me into the birch. Yeah. If I need it. But I probably won't. All right, I think this is a good place to start building. Ooh, beautiful sunset, fiery sky, will burn us all. It. My storage room is my pride and joy because this is probably the best storage room I've built. So far. can I see it? Yeah. Oh, is this? <gasps> yeah. Oh my god, that's so cute! Oh my it's god, so this is colorful. Adorable. I'm just not ready. I love it. That is so cute, girl. And the nice cool thing is, while I was hollowing this out, there's a cave system. So I was Ooh. like, oh, perfect. So it's connected to my storage room. And Ooh, next... you're going to have a fun time exploring. I'm not going to tell you what's down here, but it's going to be a fun time exploring. <laughs> I found a scary dude and he's dying. I'm running away. Watch out, you got a lot of death in there. I, I figured I would. <laughs> I mean, it spawns in my house, too, so it doesn't help. And also in my front lawn. Oh my god, why? I don't know. This biome tends to um, have a lot of evil things spawn a lot. No, oh, and I thought- but I slowly realized, and it happens in my house a lot too. <gasps> oh, you gotta light that stuff up, girl. I did, and they still spawn. <laughs> <laughs> so I was like, oh, great. So they just like to be inside my house. Sir, I'm gonna need you to evacuate the premise. In my windows. It's a little, it's a little too pretty for you here. I'm just sorry, you're just gonna have to go. The caves like, are underground. Yeah. I think he really likes that blue tree. Yeah, he's just like, you know what? This is my home too, okay? And that's fair. You know what, Ogre? You live where you very well please. You are welcome. Just don't kill us. Got it? I mean, at least my griefing's off, so you can't destroy anything. Oh, yeah, that's a good point.
since I started building? Three hours? A long time. Long time? Oh, well, I've been about three or four hours. Well, anyways, uh, I've been building for a long time. Uh, and we kind of built something big, and I'm honestly not really sure if it's gonna work out. But let's go take a look! Oh, wait a minute. Wait, 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 wait. You, wait, you, you didn't, you didn't see anything. Let's take a look! Boom! I just thought everything had to render in, but look! It's a tree! Oh, I'm actually- wait, are the- are the leaves not waving? Am I too far away? I'll be happy if the leaves don't wave because that'll be a little bit less fly while I'm in a tree and... Yeah, so we have- we have a floating island base. I'm actually really excited for it. It's really, really cute. Uh, I might need to ask Angel if she could, uh, help build a bridge like this just for the beginning part while we transition it to the rest of the bridge that I have built. Um, but... I'm actually really excited. It's super magical. I'm intending to be able to fly up there, but just in case I'm hungry or I need to get away from something or have a visit or anything like that, uh, we can walk up this gentle, gentle slope all the way up to the top. And I did build a couple of little extra islands. We have one island here, which I didn't add any like way to bounce back up onto that platform or anything. Um, that's okay. I can always fly over the platform. Um, I also never added an area of way to get over there, but we could, hopefully we can fly. If not, I'll build a pathway up there. We have our little waterfalls flowing down. We have, it's, it's very scenic, very lovely. That area is going to be for some like horses and stuff like that. Actually, let's go fly over there. Um, this is all going to be for horses and stuff. Um, down here is probably, if it doesn't, if it's just... If it's not just a platform, it might be a farm, but I might not, this might just actually just be a platform. I haven't decided yet because there's actually a ton of space that I haven't used and we'll get over there. Uh, right, so you take this gentle slope up 
and then you get to the bottom of the tree and you can go inside. Um, that's if you can't make it to the top already. There is a way down here that you can get up. Just climb the ladder. First floor here, close the trap door. We have uh, right, right now it's just an empty room, <laughs> but it's going to be a kitchen and food storage area And then over here we'll have a cute little eating area nook. Uh, I thought that that'd be cute um, I, I feel like I don't actually do a lot of like decorative rooms uh, And that's just kind of my style. This is probably gonna be the only decorative room really um, That's gonna look like a kitchen with a little eating area. Um, I don't know why I just I feel like uh like I don't really use them so I, I usually don't build them uh, but we had a lot of space so I figured why not uh, going across the hall over here this is going to be my bedroom area uh, so the bed is going to go there I might put glass there so I can see the stars and then up here we have another little scenic area we have a little uh, rooftop area here we can see Pershi's house down there I think that's Bree's house we can kind of actually see a lot of uh, everyone's houses because everybody built really close together which is really nice to have like a little sense of community and honestly it'll make like gift giving easier too oh good look the vines are the vines are growing I wonder how much they're gonna grow I don't really know uh, so that is that area Ooh, we need a little bit more light over there anyways uh, that kind of helped a little bit bit uh hopefully that's still light enough going down these stairs over here this is where we're going to have our little enchantment room and a brewing stand now back here there's actually still a lot more uh tree that i could definitely use and i hear a spider and i no doubt there's probably some spiders in here um but there's still a whole big area over here that we could use as like a farm or something um we can figure that out later when we when we need it. Okay. Aside from that, uh, I never added another another ladder here. Uh, there we go. Uh, this is actually going to be the storage area. Uh, so actually, let's just fill this in a little bit more because that's going to be a double chest place. Um, we're gonna have some armor stands over here, double chests, drawers over there. I mean, that's pretty much it. This is just a uh, basic storage room. Over here is probably going to be an animal area, a little bit of a sanctuary, a little bit of a... I, I hate to say it, but like, it's, it's not really like a collection. But there's a good chance that I'm going to get a lot of animals, because there's so many mo creatures! Uh, so I figured that a couple of them could live in here, and then eventually, if uh, depending on the animal, if I need to fence it off, I will. Uh, but some of our animals can live in here, and then we can decorate it for the animal uh, as we find it appropriate. But I'm pretty sure that's actually all there is to my house. It really isn't a lot. It took a while to build because there's just a lot to to figure out because we kind of did this all in like one go, um, and I didn't pre-plan any of it whatsoever. So. I think that's pretty much gonna be it. It looks so beautiful though. I'm really proud of it. I hope you guys, you guys like it too. So feel free to let me know your thoughts. Uh, do you guys like the build? Do you guys think that I planned it poorly? Or do you think that it'll work just fine for what we need it to be? Um, I don't know. We're gonna, we're gonna have to test it out and find out. In the next episode, uh, I want to do some mining. We're going to get uh, basically our stuff organized, probably a little bit of decoration. We have a ton to do still. There's like a ton. Uh, we might stream in between, so we can probably do a little bit of decoration during a stream. That probably might make the most sense. Um, but other than that, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure to leave a like and don't forget to subscribe to me and to everybody else in the description down below. And we will see you guys in the next one. Bye!